Ross. Hi, my name is Anna, and I'm a singer. Hi, my name is Peyton, and I'm a dancer. And today, what are we doing today? Today, we are back with a very exciting comeback reaction to a very special person, and we'll be reacting to Wan Ho in his newest music video. Yes, so Wan Ho is back with a new song called Blue, all caps. Obviously, we have watched the teaser in advance, so we kind of know what to expect. I don't know, when it comes to Wan Ho, I like expect us to be blushing and like covering our faces the entire music video, but this music video concept based on the teaser is like he's in high school for this. So, yeah. we'll see. Let's just go. Go. <laughs> I like it. I like it too. <laughs> yeah, it's very, very, very summer. For us, like, much as we were like, oh, is it high school football? I will say he does fit that, like, yeah, stereotype very character. well. Yeah. The athlete who's actually into music and dancing? Wow. Oh my god, is it high school musical? <laughs> but for football instead of basketball? Yeah, it's like every summer teen movie. This is like his Cheongnam concept. Oh my god. I like that. Ah, uh, here's what I expect from a one song. Oh, was he not wearing a shirt under his jacket? Uh-uh. Uh, oh! That's cute. Yeah, there's like an element of cuteness that I feel like fits his personality really well. Cause he looks so like tough, but then he's really cute. His off-stage oh. persona. Yeah. Ah uh, yes, a convertible. <laughs> Oh! Wow, it's beautiful. <laughs> oh, I like how he's controlling. Mm. It's literally just teen movie. I love it. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna start from the concept and say a couple of things about that. And I literally have it written down here. This is the way it's written. Yeah, the high school concept ain't for me anymore. <laughs> That's kind of like the joke, but I will say, I did really enjoy the fact that he got to show more of that like cuter side. Like we kind of started mentioning in the reaction, his offstage persona, like his personality is so cute that I think people miss that when he does concepts like his previous releases that are more serious, sensual. But also I thought it was funny because it reminded me of how like 16 year olds and teen movies are always played by people in like their late 20s and early 30s. And you're like, no one in high school looks like that. And I'm like, I wish people in my high school had looked like that. <laughs> And maybe because even though it's a high school concept, I don't see him like as a high schooler. But there were a couple of times where like his facials, I was like, oh, chinkoos. 
because please remember that I have adored this man since No Mercy. It's been a very long time since he's been in my heart. Onto the dance though, it's so much lighter than the dances for his other concepts, which like makes sense with the song with the concept, but just like one super noticeable difference was his previous releases. The dances were very grounded, like they're very into the floor, very settled. And this one is very light. It almost feels like he's full of air. Like there is a lot of jumping in this, but not just that, even when he's just like dancing, it doesn't feel like he's touching the ground, almost like this floating feeling, which was nice to see. Like it is kind of very refreshing. Something I really liked about it though, is there's so much footwork, especially in the phrases for the chorus. There's a lot of just like small details where he'll do like an extra like twist or an extra step or like cross over for just a little bit more of like a fancy detail. And I thought that was interesting for the football concept because footwork is something that like football players practice a lot, like having fast like feet that you can move around, but also everyone knows like one of the main ways to my heart is having good footwork and just I just love it so much but also something else is this dance is a little bit trendier than his previous dances have been because again it's just the style of dance is a little bit trendier he's got some of those more like TikTok sort of moves in it I haven't seen the TikTok challenge yet but I'm sure that it's like the chorus choreography but finally my last note I really liked how it rode the rhythm because it's just an easy song to like listen to and sing along to and dance to and he really embodies that when I appreciate that they didn't try to overcomplicate the choreography because it wouldn't have fit the song and the concept they're going for. Like the way that we were just sort of like swaying as we were, or like you're doing right now, like swaying as you're listening to it or like thinking about it. That's the feeling you get from the dance too. Like all of the movements where he kind of like controls their heads on the sustain notes or when they're like going down. It's sort of like they've just choreographed the swaying and I really like that. So yeah, overall, a win for me. Anna's turn. So it's time for my comments. Now, and where to begin? Let's start from the beginning. I really, really like the little clinky noises that you hear in the background that are also the background percussion later in the song for a decent amount of it. It's very like light, sort of playful feeling and like the clinks that you're hearing are more high pitched so it like breaks it up a little bit more. And overall, the song is like playful and laid back, kind of sounds like opposites, but it is both of those. It's just like, I mean, the song is called Blue. Obviously they want you to think of water. So just think of like, the summer's day at the beach or something like that kind of like playful you're having a good relaxing time but it's also still laid back because it's still kind of relaxing hanging out so other little things that they use in the instrumental for that like pre-chorus they switch to snap sounds more because it gets a little bit more it's a little laid back style but then like chorus they use more like clap sounds you also hear the bass line that is a simple bass line it's pretty straightforward just like one two three four but then towards the end of the measure or end of phrase, it will have like slight syncopation. So like simple laid back feel, but it still has like a slight groove to it. They also have like playful guitar line that comes in that I think I mentioned in the reaction. I was like, I like that guitar line. And then also towards the end of the song, they also start using a more like of a synth with that. One thing that I really, really liked though was I mentioned earlier, like obviously they're trying to make you think of like water waves in the song at some point. So like into the chorus, they have the perk like sort of crash and it sounds like a wave crashing. Also good for like transition moment into the chorus. Another thing that's adding to that feeling is his voice. The melody in itself is like higher pitched. I mean, most one more songs are, but also there's reverb on it and like the sort of effect that they have put on it for one thing it can like make it feel otherworldly like fantasy world which like basically this whole music video he's like in a movie or it also can make it feel like you're like outside and you especially get more of like the outside feeling during the bridge because there's also like a sort of response voices too that have even more heavy like reverb effect on it and speaking of other voices just like throughout the whole song background vocals are beautiful like in the chorus too but last two things one small thing the percussion that i mentioned at the beginning i like how it closes the end so it's like into the movie storyline and then out of the movie storyline and then also i just the bridge when it changes and then like he also does into the final chorus just like singing no instrumental basically i was like wow this is a movie this is literally like the uh, high school like like a decom or it made me think of um a cinderella story but it doesn't start raining so 
But anyways, those are all of my comments. So TLDR for this reaction is One Hole is back with a very refreshing, very light concept, a new side of him in his music, showing a little bit more of his offstage personality through this song. And it was just a very fun, chill, laid back, good summer song that also made us think of our, Dis our Disney Channel original movies. Yeah. <laughs> But that being said, if you also love Won Ho and his new release and want to talk more about him, this song, anything really, then feel free to reach out on our socials, which are linked in the cards. And as always, if you enjoyed this reaction video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on your notification bell, and bye! bye.